and to security, let's turn to Boronu, where President Muhammad Buhari is confident that peace will fully be restored in the Northeast and other regions bedeviled by insecurity before the end of his administration. The president gave the assurance through his chief of staff, Ibrahim Gambari, at the inauguration of 804 reconstructed housing units in Ngaranam community of Mafa local council. TVC News, Jesse Tafida reports. Garanum was one of the communities ravaged by Boko Haram insurgents in 2015, resulting in the displacement of hundreds of families who before now had taken refuge in IDP camps. This housing unit was constructed with the Regional Stabilization Facility, funded by the federal Borno State Government in collaboration with the United Nations and the international community. The Garanam facility is one of the nine facilities in the Northeast initiated to ensure the safe and dignified resettlement of persons displaced by insurgency. This project. President Mohamed Buhari is represented by his chief of staff, Professor Ibrahim Gambari, at this event. He expresses the federal government's commitment to rebuilding all destroyed communities and restoring normalcy in the region. He praises the state governor, Baba Ganazulum, for his commitment to catering for the needs of his people who have been victims of insurgency. Mr. President has asked me to also reaffirm his commitment and that of the federal government to the recovery and stabilization of Bornu State and that of the Northeast uh, geopolitical zone, whose people have suffered too long and too deeply as victims of violent extremism and terrorism. We are here to support you and we will continue to support you until you don't need us. Each household that will be resettled in Garanam will be supported with a grant of 100,000 Naira, cattle, food and non-food items. This project is no doubt a great contribution to our stabilization and development effort. It is an example of how we want to ultimately see people from each of our 27 local government areas settled back in their communities and build back their lives. We have a long way to go. Of the 500 housing units, 360 have been completed including a health facility, a school, a police station, and a market. Jessica Fida, TVC News, Maiduguri.